The humble. Quartz brick. Quartz bricks. A feature that many have been asking for for years. A feature that many believe should have been implemented when the other quartz blocks were. That is not all. There is a future of blocks like these. If Mojang keeps on adding blocks similar to this, the game may lose its simplicity, but it may also allow for more creativity. Let's get into today's video. Hello. And today, I present to you... There's a village there. I present to you... The Better Slabs mod! Yay! It's the Better Slabs mod. So, this Better Slab mod doesn't only add vertical slabs. It also adds a load of different slabs, like, um, like this. Ta-da! It's like a thing. It's like a slope, see? Genius. And then there's these. See, bookshelf slabs. Like, look at this. This is a normal Minecraft grass path staircase thing. But then this is it with the better slabs mod. And... I'll leave this in the, I'll leave all these mods in the description. You can build stuff that's ugly. You can build whatever you want. See, it's amazing. See, it's absolutely amazing. And then like, just by looking at this, you can see what you can do with these different blocks. And this is why Mojang should add these sort of new blocks to their game. So this mod adds like almost not just vertical slabs and slopes, but slabs of every single block. So if I took a bedrock slab for example, I could have slopes of bedrock. And then I could have, if I wanted to, maybe that and then that and then that. I mean, I wouldn't want that, but it's it's pretty cool. Like, I'm just saying, this is like you can just see what you what you could build with this, like magma slabs. <laughs> if I got vertical magma slabs at a slope, I but it would look cool. You could build something cool out of this. I I don't know what I could build, but look, it looks like a person, see? Amazing. Build the rest of him, see? Vertical. That's the rest of his body, see? Look at him. He's beautiful. I'll make his head out of oak leaves. It's amazing, see? Beautiful. So, moving on to the next mod. So here's another Minecraft mod. Now this mod is the styled blocks mod that I'll also leave in the description. So this had smooth stone bricks, wooden bars, seared iron bars, styled raw stone, styled polished raw stone, and like many different wood types and glass types and um and there's also there is also columns which are like walls except they don't stick together so that that could be you could be quite creative with that then there's polished raw stone which is like normal stone but polished which should be a feature added into minecraft because it makes sense because there's polished granite diorite and andesite but no polished stone off-center dark bricks which are quite good 
and these are poles so poles as you can see you can be quite creative I made like um, a little shack balcony thing and I used these trap doors to make a nice wooden door and as you can see there is many 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 blocks um yeah many blocks so there's many different wood types as you can see and there's many different yeah so there's also upright slabs just like in the last mod it adds upright slabs but not quite to the same degree these checkerboard um blocks are, would be quite useful as well so then there's obsidian rods i'm not sure that's for but as you can see it adds many different blocks and you can just be really creative with this i'll leave the link in the description and you guys can post in my discord what you come up with okay so next up is the blockers mod um i'll also have this mod linked in the description it's on creator of this one if you're watching this make it huge but 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 it, it is a really good one this is a really good one so first thing it adds hedges hedges are a great thing they're like walls except for leaves and they look pretty aesthetic unless of course you're in the desert like me um also adds different variants of barrels so these are just all the new types of wood that the mod adds whoops as you can see, wood. They add lots of wood. And um, yeah, moving on. Uh, these are like barriers, so caution barriers, and road barriers. And these ones, I love these. Like I love these. These are amazing. Um, so there's rainbow brick walls and coloured tiles. So coloured tiles are really useful for building. So as you can see, there's many different variants, but then these are rainbow versions. As you can see the rainbow versions change colour, but yeah. So then there's these really cool lava and water brick walls. And then there's blaze brick walls, obsidian brick walls. There's just so many different blocks and there's so many different choices for what you're building. You can just choose anything. And these paper doors don't really stick to the walls properly, but they're pretty cool. Um, this is the love block. the love block um this is a gate um i think you can activate it with redstone so if i get yeah it's like an iron door except it looks a bit cooler it's like an iron door but with iron bars there this is some of the doors from the other woods white oak and i think this is gonna be my new intro thing this thing looks amazing I mean, if you if you watch this far into the video, then you'll know if this is my intro or not. But mmm. So as you can see, there's many different colors of redstone lamps. That one is rainbow, and there's so many different colors. There's also these um, pink future neo blocks, which I think are really cool. There's these caution blocks, which I think is a nice touch. Um, and then there's all these classic blocks like bricks stone cutters and then there's the um crying obsidian fire glowing obsidian and um another reactor core so these are all old blocks um crying obsidian was actually brought back and i think another reactor core may have been in pocket edition but basically these are like old legacy blocks and then the legacy sponge it's, oh, like they changed the texture like twice now like the second texture wasn't so great. This one is okay, but the old one was the best. Like, seriously, everyone knows that that old one is the best. Then this is legacy planks, and this is a ender block, which is pretty cool. Um, and then there's red patterned wall, which works in the same sort of way as um, glazed terracotta, and they've actually added pillars of glazed terracotta here. There's also a lot of beveled glass. And then these ones I really like. So large bricks and zigzag bricks. So I could definitely see where these could 
come in really handy in builds, especially for these ones, these zigzag bricks. Um, there's the Nether Stars block, which just adds a new thing of why you would want to get Nether Stars. Oh, and it gives me effects. Absorption strength for new generation. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Like a beacon, but multi <laughs> Um, lantern blocks are another thing. And then there's this circular pavement, which I thought was quite cool. Um, I'm not sure I would use this in my builds, but it's it's pretty cool. It comes in a ton of different variants. Then there's the chisel bath marble pillars. And this isn't even all of it. There is a lot to this mod. Um, so that is why I recommend you um, you you download this, use it. It's a fabric mod, but I hope you do it anyway. And um, I'm gonna leave the I definitely did exploring these new sort of things that could be added to the game. And hope you have a great day. Bye!